Yo, I am Jacques Slade, and these are the top stories of the day from Diodora, Jordan Brand, and Nike Sportswear. This is Today in Sneaks. Old school sneakerheads rejoice as a classic brand, Diodora has linked up with Scottish shop Hannon on the N9000. As you can tell, this is the runner, and the color choices by Hannon are pretty much on point. As you all well know, Diodora isn't a name that you hear every day or often here in the States, but taking a look at these, you probably should. Inspired by English transit lines, the model features pig suede, leather, and mesh on the upper, and their nickname, the Saturday Night Special Transit 2. You can look for these to release on November 1st in store, and if any pairs are left, online later that same day. Now these actually popped up last week, but you can grab them this weekend, the White Ostrich Nike KD7 Lifestyle. As the name suggests, the model features the ostrich leather upper with leather straps for the lace stays. The big highlight is the icy blue translucent outsole that pops off of that white upper, but the quiet details are what really helps shape this model in my opinion. The tongue tag and the heel pool feature native inspired prints based on the area around OKC. Sealing the deal is a gold Nike swoosh and you can grab these on October 31st for $115. Finally, Jordan Brand unleashed a litany, that's a big word I'm using there, of sneakers today to highlight the NBA's opening night, from Blake Griffin and the Superfly 3 to Kawhi Leonard and the Jordan 29. The whole collection takes team colors into account and creates unique looks on each of the sneakers. Chris Paul's CP38, which doesn't actually release until next week, has clipper colors all over it, and as does Carmelo Anthony's New York Knicks-inspired Mellow M10. George Brand even created a look for the rookie Jabari Parker, inspired by the Bucks on the M10 as well. And if that wasn't enough, the brand also announced that they've added rookies Tyler Ennis, Noah Vinlay, and James Young, as well as the veteran for it, LaMarcus Aldridge, to the Jordan Brand team. As for the question of the video, I want to know who do you think is going to win the NBA Finals? I am a Lakers fan, so I'm dealing with some internal things right now, so I won't say who I think is going to win, but I want to know who you think is going to win the NBA Finals this year. Let me know right there down in the comments. As always, if you haven't, make sure you like, favorite, and subscribe. That way you know whenever something awesome is happening right here on this channel. And of course, I have a link down there in the description that'll give you the full story on everything that I talked about today. Well, I am your host, Jacques Slade. This is Today in Sneaks, and as always, guys, I appreciate you. You. I'll see you soon. Peace. Turn on the upper that allows it to still remain visible. I actually wore, trained, or I guess wore test these in the Elite socks, and I usually wear just the regular Nike dry fit socks, and my foot didn't feel really hot. I wear the dry fit one just because I feel like my feet get really hot really quickly, and I didn't.